He paid his way through college as a handyman, growing that small business into the largest construction company in the state with a thousand employees and a reputation for ethical behavior. He's an Ironman triathlete, an avid cyclist and outdoorsman, an adventurer who summited Mount Everest with frostbitten toes and a leg still healing from a recent break. During his two terms as governor, he did what people in office rarely do. He kept his word. A Republican, he was re-elected in a state that votes two to one Democrat in a landslide. He vetoed wasteful spending 750 times, cut taxes 14 times, reduced the size of state government through better management instead of layoffs. He left the people of his state with hundreds of miles of new highways, new schools and bridges, improved state services, a balanced budget, and a billion dollar surplus all without raising taxes a penny. He's fiscally conservative and socially cool. GQ magazine declared him the sanest man running for president and described him as absurdly honest and smart. He will be on the ballot in all 50 states come November as an alternative to Mitt Romney and Barack Obama. His name is Gary Johnson. Gary Johnson isn't the norm in politics, he's the future. Gary Johnson can fix the America the two-party system is broken. He's a handyman. My name is Gary Johnson. Be libertarian with me for one election. Live free.